So we're doing Shoehorn Sonata again, Lorraine and I, and uh, when we first did it for the world premiere in 1995, it went to London and Susanna York and Maggie Kirkpatrick played the roles and John was really keen to go. When I said to him, well, why don't you go? And he said, oh, Sandra, they can afford, they can afford to put me up, but they can't afford the airfares. And he said, he said, you know, it's hard as a writer. It's, I, I just don't actually think I can afford to go, which I found very disappointing because I thought, you know, it's a big event. A little while later, he was awarded the highest financially rewarding uh, award that has ever been given in theatre, and it was 20000 and it was for the best play celebrating 50 years of since the Second World War. And uh, we had a little ceremony here, which was lovely at the theatre. And I thought, I was so thrilled, I thought, now John can go to the opening. And he got the cheque and he handed it to the army nurses. They, oh gosh, they didn't have a, um, they didn't have a memorial anywhere. And uh, now they had their memorial. Well, the time now that we're doing it, this is going to be the third run here at the Ensemble for Shuhorn Sonata. Originally, it was with Maggie Kirkpatrick and Melissa Jaffa. And then the next pairing was us in 1999. And it was just, it's just the most wonderful play. So we're both over the moon about doing it again, except for all the lines we've got to learn, because there's so many, but they're beautiful words. And it's, it's such a wonderful play to see because you're getting drama, you're getting information that uh, is true, absolutely true. And amazingly, for a, a play about two women who were prisoners of war, it's very funny. So there's a great deal of entertainment in it and enrichment from watching this play. I think it's, it's definitely way up the top there of one of mine and I've done 45 now. <laughs> we love it, don't we? We love it, yes. <laughs> John Misto is so clever. And, and in fact, in the 30 years that I've been artistic director, I've only uh, hit the stage twice both times in this play with Lorraine. <laughs> and Lorraine and I have known each other for such a long time. A hundred so. years. <laughs> oh, we worked out that between us, this is my maths, we're 155 years plus. Are we nuts to be doing this? Yes, but isn't it good? I mean, because you, you, you know the joy that we're getting from doing it, but the joy that the people are getting, and it's not just joy, it's fulfilment, it's information, it's, it's just a wondrous play. And... Uh, John Misto is the most beautiful, beautiful, sensitive um, and articulate writer. Um, it's it's a, a joy to do, an absolute joy to do. Yes, in fact, that generosity and kind of giving it to the army nurses shows up in generosity of spirit in his writing. So it's truly beautiful. Mm -hmm.